Hello everybody and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 19. We just made it through the Horde night. I went down and did a little bit of grinding down in our mine. Not a whole lot, but got us some sand going on so we can make more concrete. I went ahead and got everything picked up from this side so we have room for a workbench and a chemi station. We can't make the chemi station yet. We can't make the workbench because we're short on mechanical parts. So I got a wrench with us. Today we're going to be wrenching down some cars as we go around. Whenever we see a full car, we'll wrench it down and see what we get. Because I could use a couple motors. I could use the mechanical parts. Stuff like that. So what's our game stage now? 38, we should start getting some fairly decent loot. So, I was looking at our points that we got last night. We got five points. I did stick one more into Master Chef, hoping we can make a little better food, but I just, I don't have the ingredients yet. But the stuff's unlocked. Meat stew, vegetable stew, stuff like that's unlocked. So we can make it once we start growing potatoes and corn a little bit better and maybe some mushrooms. But where to put this five points? I had thought about going a little heavier in minor 69er and mother load, but I think what we're going to do is intelligence. We're going to try to get our better barter up. If we can get to level three, the secret stash shows better loot we'll start having a chance of seeing chainsaws and augers. So, as much as I like dealing with the, the traders, I'm going to try to go down some of this tree. So, let's put one in there. The next one, we're going to have to be intellect three. So, let's just go ahead and do it. Intellect three. This is intellect five. We can't get there yet. So, what can we do with that one other point? Let's put it in Pummel Peak. That'll give us a little better, a little better with our club. So for today, I guess let's go see the trader and see if she has a job close by. I'm not going to be going to the other trader very regular just because it's like three kilometers away or whatever. It's like way over there. So until we get something gas powered, that's just a little far to go. So for today, we're going to uh, just do the trader, see if she has a quest for us. And just loot around our town, I believe. I did already come through after the horde, I believe, and check all these. No, I don't guess I did. I don't have any money with me. We'll have to come back. If you got the dukes, I'll make the time. I have no dukes, Jen. I left them all at home. Do you have any jobs? We have a clear zombie that's fairly close. You need some work? And it's I a need tier some two. Commissions. Do hurry. I have a protection payment coming up soon. So we'll run over and get that done. See a couple cars right next to us. Let's get them first. Because they're full cars. We might as well knock them out. Where's my wrench? many of these cars as I'm gonna have to wrench down over the course of this playthrough I'm probably just gonna show y'all these two and then just you know randomly throw a few in here and there because there's no need y'all sitting here watching me wrench cars for 30 minutes 
poetic. Well, that car blew up late. Was there somebody else over there? Or did this? I gotta go look. Because I know Eddie here was hitting it. But, like, that should have blown up way before that. Unless somebody else came along and hit it. What's this? Plant fibers. I don't care about plant fibers. Okay. I don't know why that took so long to blow up. Now I'm hoping this records good for y'all. I have an episode of subsistence right now uploading to YouTube. I don't know if that's going to mess up my recording. I'm hoping not. So just bear with me. But I'll see you guys over there. Alright guys, we made it over to the tier 2 clear. Before I reset it, I'm going to go ahead and check this car. And I'm going to wrench it up. That way if it respawns a new car, we'll let the two full cars will get the wrench. I don't know if they buffed it or not, but... Cool cars were hard to find last time I played, so don't want to waste any of them. Have we got any motors or anything? We've got a battery so far. We're still short motors. How many? We've got 14 mechanical parts. We need 20 to make the, uh, I was about to try to grab that because I've been playing subsistence. We need 20. To make the workbench because I was gonna make some shotgun shells before horde night but I couldn't make them without the workbench so that's something we got to get done Let's go see what we can get done in here. And I probably won't loot everything. Oh, I know this house. On Nava's game, this is the farmhouse. been a while since I've done this POI, so I don't know exactly where everything's at. Somebody's up top beating around that was from, they're from outside, they're not part of the quest. I don't know. Let's just get on through here and get this done. I'm not grabbing all that material, even though it's a bunch of it. It just take a lot of time. We'll grab all the big loot. Of course, food we'll grab. be outside making all the noise. Well, let's get her out of the way. Like I said, I'm not going to search everything. I'll search coffee. I'll try to search a few cabinets because we do need food. Ooh, that acid's good. That actually gives us five 
bottles of acid now. So if we get the Kimmy Station schematic, we should have enough to make it. Mining. What is this? Avalanche. Take 50% less damage from collapsing mines. That's something I'll actually use, probably. That I won't use, but we'll read it. I don't do brawler. Anything else in here? Ah, purse. With some soup in it. Because... Everybody carries soup in their purse. Ah, you stupid. Ah. At least he didn't infect me or nothing. Did this lady have soup in her purse? No, she was carrying some ammo. My kind of lady. in there. Grab that chair. Get the leather. Medicine cabinet. <laughs> Who we got? Oh, it's you. Alright, what's in this one? Electric fence post schematic. That's a good one. Cable guys never made it challenge. We'll go ahead and read it. It's something we'll just, we'll get as we go along. Like I won't necessarily make a special trip over there to do that. But if we're in the area, it's something you can knock out and get a little bit of experience. <laughs> Oh, dang. Multiples. Stamina. Alright, we'll let Eddie stay up there and we'll build our stamina up a little bit. I'd rather not have to use our guns if we don't have to anymore. That was a situation, though, I might should have switched over to my gun. It could have been bad. Set Eddie on fire. Alright, that's not all of them. There's another spot up here. Oh, bookcase. Let's check that. Oh, we've already got that one. Oh, we can sell it. As long as I'm finding stuff in the bookcase, I don't mind. Even if it's something I already have. It's a bag back here. Can I reach it? I've actually found a couple of good things in those bags so far. Okay, we got a nurse. Is that it right now? I bet there's more up there. Come on, nurse. No, that was it. Alright. Why is there not more? I figured there would be more zombies. What do we got in here? Nothing super great. The insulated mod could be good if we go into the cold. I think I already have one on. This impact bracing mod will be good on our boots and a little bit of ammo. Let's see if we can use any of that. My shoes. We'll use both of them. There we go. Scrap that chair. 
Let's see what's in the Shamway box. Maybe a blueberry pie. No, but we got a potato. And some sham. Right here. Oh, nothing. Oh, well, there might have been something in that. I think if you accidentally break that, it should drop the loot. Because it doesn't just disappear because you broke the bag. Oh, another bag. Nothing I care for. File cabinet. Paper. Alright guys, I'll meet you back at the trader. Alright guys, we made it back to the trader. I took down a couple more cars on the way over here. I did manage to get an engine. And I just threw some of the stuff from the cars in the bike so that we'll have room to collect our reward. Let's go see what she's going to give us. She's going to wave at us and shake her head. Now that you have some money to spend, we're running a 10% off sale for the rest of the day. Mm. Hunting rifle. We have an AK, so we don't really need it. I used to love getting a hunting rifle early game. I'd use it to take out deer, but we don't even see that many deer anymore in this alpha, so we're going to take the antibiotics. What do you have in your inventory? I've already forgot. Nerdy glasses would be good. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything I gotta have. I'd like to check our other uh, spotlight schematic. And I'd you like came to... all this way. What a waste. Yeah, let me sell her some stuff. I'd like to check our other trader out, but it's just so far away. It makes it very difficult. Yeah, I think that's all I want to sell her. Alrighty then. Stay safe out there. I think I'm going to go home and empty our inventory try to make that workbench and then we'll head over and do the Bob's Boars so I'll see you guys in a few minutes alright guys we got a workbench made I think we're going to shove it right back in this corner here boy we can still get to it and use it we still got we can shove the Kimmy station over in this corner we might have room here for a box or two if we end up needing it. So, I'm going to head over to Bob's Boars, and I will meet you guys there. Oh, hang on just a second. We got an extra skill point while we were out. Let's see. Can we go another level in Huntsman? No. What do we need to get to this next level? Intelligence 5. Let's start pumping it in here. Alright, I'll meet you guys over there. Alright guys, we made it to Carl's Corn and Bob's Boars. I'm not even... It's been so long since I did this POI, I'm not even sure where you're supposed to go in at. I mean, we're just here for the meat and stuff, so... Oh, this is dead corn. Oh, they want you to go in down here. I bet. Well, maybe not. No, they don't. Okay. Let's try this other side. By Grace's cage. Ooh. Spooky. Yeah, here's where we go in.
I'm not sure if I can take out Grace, I'm going to be honest. I don't have any good guns with me. Of course it sprained my leg. Why wouldn't it? Okay, how do we want to do this? I think the only way we can do this, possibly, is if I go to this side somewhere and dig my way out. Because Grace is a bit mean. I think we're going to start using the iron shovel, so I'll scrap that. Alright. What I'm going to have to do is get Grace's attention. I'm going to have to run back where she can't get to me. Make it through here? Not really. But I don't need her to make it through here either. Can I get through there now? Yeah. Alright. Oh, that got her attention. Oh, 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 she does some damage. Ah, uh, we died. Good thing this is not a permadeath series. So. We are just going to head straight back over. Oh man, it's nighttime too. Oh, you know what I need? I need something to kill Grace. The blunderbust apparently is not going to do it. I was thinking I could get her killed before she made it through there. Alright, let's take the AK... Take some armor piercing ammo and some regular ammo. Oh, and shoot. Oh, Grace went back down to her spot there. I can't hold it all. So we'll eat some of this food I was trying to save. Toss out the and that and that's everything oh yeah I know monkey died I hit the wrong button there I meant to hit the R okay now revenge on Gracie Reload, reload, reload the regular ammo. Ha ha! Gracie died. I did so much damage to her, it took some of the meat away. But, I mean, 71 meat? That's a good amount. Oh, let's go grab this loot. I'll come back and get the rest of the bones. And everything off camera. What do we got? Ooh, baseball bat. 
which a level one I'm not worried about. We're gonna keep that crossbow. Yeah. Did a wandering horde follow me down here or something? Ah, dang it. Is that everybody? Uh, let's get everybody cleared out. That way we can end the episode. Just not having good luck this episode. But since it's night time, I don't want anybody over here bothering us while I finish looting. Goodbye, Arlene. Okay. I believe everybody's out of the way. Ah, oh, dang it. George. People heard us. Alright, let's get everybody cleared out. I think that's everybody. Alright guys. I'm gonna throw this up here so nobody jumps in behind me. Dang it. Alright, never mind. Let's get this loot. Weapons bag. Ooh, ergonomic grip. I need that. Is this going to disappear when I get out of it? No. Okay, that's good. So I will just show you guys the loot. And I may have to make a run or two back to the house. Yeah, nothing super great anyway. Those I can just scrap. What we got in here? Nothing I care about. Alright guys. That's going to be it for this episode. I'm going to spend the rest of the night clearing out all the bodies that I ran past. And trying to get some of that cement dug up. Because that was a ton of cement. I hate to just leave it. So I will see you guys in the next episode i hope you enjoyed it if you did hit the like and subscribe for me all right guys it's the next morning i've made it back to the base i'm gonna throw this in at the end of the last video to show y'all what i was able to get now this doesn't include the stuff that i showed y'all in the boxes and what have you this is just stuff I went back and shoveled in the meat we got. We got a thousand cobblestone. We got one, two, three, three thousand thirty-eight cement. That is a good chunk of cement. Got one, two, three, four, a little over four stacks of meat. That'll last us a little while. 183 leather, 911 bones, 111 fat, and 27 super corn. So that's a pretty good haul.